you need to understand for a consultation you only have eight minutes eight minutes that's it so in these eight minutes you have to take a proper history you need to talk about the management plan we need to come to a diagnosis and also you need to address patients concerns so when you practice these skills you will realize that it's not a lot of time to do all of these things for example a history might be really long or the management might be too big or the patient might have so many questions that need to be addressed so in what happens in these cases is that the student tends to talk really fast they do not sympathize and empathize with the patient they miss on all sorts of verbal and non-verbal cues and then sometimes they even talk over the patient all in the effort of finishing the consultation if you take that approach you are going to definitely score very low marks in your interpersonal skills and god forbid fail the plap to exams that you don't want to if you just want to ask if, if i would tell you about my own most of the cases that i did not all there were so many cases most of them I was not able to finish up with the consultation. I did a history because during history, the patient had concerns. He showed me facial expression. So I continuously stopped. Like, is there anything bothering you? So by the time I had come to the end, I just had one or two lines to talk about the management. And the doctors understood that. They said, this is understandable. But, but the patient says, he made me feel really good. So I think it's good.